Okay, so I got contacted from a website called banggood.com, which is something like Amazon, but it ships from China. It has half the prices, a longer delivery time because it ships directly from China. But anyway, they contacted me and said, hey, do you want to feed ukulele? I said, sure. And they said, you have to do a review and post it on your channel. And I said, sure. So let's see what they sent me. Okay, so the ukulele is called Enya X1 and this is the 23 inch version. In other words, this is a concert ukulele. It has a jack so you can plug it in speakers. And let's see what we have inside. We have this thing. I don't know what is it. And we have this thing. Oh, <laughs> let's see. Okay. Really good case, by the way. This, this ukulele, all this thing cost $130. Uh, and I think they have a free shipping. I'm not sure that they sent me with the free shipping because it arrived in two weeks, I think, something like that. Uh, I've never bought anything from this website, but what I've read on the internet is that it takes sometimes 40 days if you take the free shipping. However, there are other options, but you have to pay for them. Yeah. So this is the ukulele. Let's see what we have here. All right, it looks... It looks pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, solid. Yeah, actually, it, pr it looks pretty good. Hmm. Okay, let's see what we have in this bag right here. We have Enya strap. Oh. I'll definitely use this one. Oh, this is a good thing. Hey, thank you. What else? Well, we have a lot of things here. Enya tuner and a battery for it. Let me put the battery. Oh, here it is. It light it up. Huh, it, it's one of these tuners that you can put right here somewhere. Anyway, I'll never use this one because I'm using my phone to tune the ukulele. It's always with me. I don't need this thing, but thank you. What is this? Oh, ukulele strings. They send you another pair of strings nice what is this a capo they've sent you a capo and this is a ukulele capo this is not a guitar capo let's see how it fits oh that's nice i've never had a ukulele capo it's a little bit plastic though maybe maybe it will broke someday anyway what's this finger shaker <laughs> what 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 Okay, so we have a finger shaker now. Uh, th this is apparently a thing. I never knew. Anyway, what do we have here? Oh, pigs. Two different sizes of pigs. Thank you. I'm always out of pigs because I always lose them. So thank you very much. This is much appreciated. What else? We have some book with... I cannot read it because it's all in Chinese. We have some tabs here advertising stuff more advertising stuff one more thing what is this oh it is a cleaning cloth i guess or what is it maybe it's a good idea to to use one of these things once in a while oh and you have a two with which you can adjust the grip from this thing right here just screw it on the one side you make it loose screw it on the other side you make it tight okay this is good a lot of things actually i'll use this one okay so let's put this thing and uh let's try to tune the ukulele with the tuner that they gave us okay oh it's a it's pretty good strap by the way i like it okay the ukulele sounds awful right now let's power this thing up oh and it lies in green when you're on the right tone. It's always a good idea to kind of uh, pull the strings a little bit when you're first tuning the ukulele to tighten up right here. But of course, when it's new, you have to tune it a, a few times in a week for sure. Oh, finally. Oh, 
it sounds pretty good actually. Clean sound. Oh, let's try this one. So, what, how does it work? You put it. <laughs> this is not a bad idea, maybe. I don't know. Well, I don't know. I'll try to. I'll put it on my ring finger and pretend that I'm married. So I just uh, took a further look on it and I didn't found the controls for the volume and the tone and I looked inside and it is inside which is kind of strange decision to be honest. You have to put your finger inside and control it but just a second. I'm taking care of the environment. Okay so um, this is pretty strange, but it's kind of okay. What is really, really strange is that the battery that uh, powers the, the piezo, it's right behind that. And I don't really see how to, probably you have to remove the strings to change the batteries. Uh, this is kind of an issue for me because when you're on a gig, for example, and you realize that you're out of power, and you have to change your uh, batteries. With this ukulele, you'll have to change your strings too, or at least loosen them up a lot. I don't know, it's just, but anyway, let's try to play a song. Blackbird singing in the red of night. Baby's broken wings and learn to fly all your life. You were only waiting for this moment to arrive. <laughs> it sounds good. Blackbird singing in the dead of night. Baby's singing eyes and learn to see. So we should definitely check it out how it sounds when it's plugged in the in the speaker. So let's go to the bar and see how it sounds there.
quiet though. Maybe I need to change the batteries, I don't know, but still sounds okay. <laughs> I mean, for, for 130 bucks, I think it's a very good deal. So, there will be a link in the description if you want to check it out. But just remember that it ships from China, so. Uh, Pay a little extra for fast delivery and yeah. Thank you Banggood.com for the gift. I appreciate it. And uh, thank you guys for watching. And I hope this was fun. I don't know, it was fun for me. Anyway, bye bye.